the banks of the Grand Canal are lined with more than 170 buildings, most of which date from the 13th to the 18th century, and demonstrate the welfare and art created by the Republic of Venice. The noble Venetian families faced huge expenses to show off their richness in suitable Palazzos. This contest reveals the citizens' pride and the deep bond with the lagoon. Amongst the many are the Palazzi Barbaro, C.A. Resinico, C.A. D'Oro, Palazzo Dario, C.A. Foscari, Palazzo Barbarigo and de Palazzo Venier di Leone, housing the Peggy Guggenheim collection. The churches along the canal include the Basilica of Santa Maria della Salute. Centuries-old traditions, such as the historical regatta, it are perpetuated every year along the canal. Because most of the city's traffic goes along the canal rather than across it, only one bridge crossed the canal until the 19th century, the Rialto Bridge. There are currently three more bridges, the Pont degli Scalzi, the Pont dell'Accademia, and the controversial Pont della Costituzione from 2008, designed by Santiago Calatrava, connecting the train station to Piazzale Roma, one of the few places in Venice where buses and cars can enter. As was usual in the past, people can still take a ferry ride across the canal at several points by standing up on the deck of a simple gondola called the Traghetto. Although this service is less common than even a decade ago, when most of the palaces emerge from water without pavement, consequently, one can only tour past the fronts of the buildings on the Grand Canal by boat. The Grand Canal probably follows the course of an ancient river, possibly a branch of the Brenta, flowing into the lagoon. Adriatic Veneti groups already lived beside the formerly named Rio Bisniacus before the Roman age. They lived in stilt houses and on fishing and commerce, mainly salt. Under the rule of the Roman Empire and later of the Byzantine Empire the lagoon became populated and important, and in the early 9th century the Doge moved his seat from Malamocco to the safer Rivaltus clarification needed. Increasing trade followed the Doge and found in the deep Grand Canal a safe and ship accessible canal port. Drainage reveals that the city became more compact over time. At that time the canal was wider and flowed between small tide-subjected islands connected by wooden bridges.